Welcome to the World Hero News for the 4th of July 2024. Holy Spirit, show us what we need to hear in spiritual news today. Two of Cups, Temperance. It's Valentine's Day all over again. 14th of February. Somebody wants to apologize for something to a person they love. 25 or 52 could be significant. The Seven of Wands. Something could be happening on the 25th of July. There's something wrong in this picture. Somebody has some unfinished business. Four of Swords, Nine of Cups. This person really wants to sleep with someone. This is an Aries man who wants to sleep with somebody from their past. This could be somebody who went on a date on the 14th of February or wanted to go on a date with someone on the 14th of February. Yes, it's true. Ten of Wands. This person is very frustrated. That's what I'm getting with the Ace of Wands and the Ten of Wands because they didn't get to go on that date on the 14th of February. So they are postponing the date for the 25th of July now. They're going to try again. This person is going to try again. Possibly on the 25th of July. Nine of Pentacles. The Hierophant. Knight of Cups. This person could even be proposing marriage to someone. Two of Wands. This is a stalker. And the world, this person is talking from across the world and they want to travel towards someone or they're waiting for somebody to travel somewhere. Possibly in August, the 21st of August is here too. So something could be happening between the 25th of July and the 21st of August. The Emperor, again with the Emperor, this is the man who wants to sleep with this person. 84 or 48 could be significant, April and May could be significant. King of Wands. There's a man here who is obsessed with sleeping with someone this summer. Ace of Pentacles. They're even willing to promise marriage just as long as they get to sleep with this person. Something's on the floor. Page of Swords. Yes, this is a stalker. And the Four of Cups. This person is being rejected or they were rejected. Somebody didn't want to go with them on the date. Knight of Wands, Five of Wands. This is somebody who's willing to take it by force with the Knight of Wands and the Five of Wands, yes. Seven of Wands, 57 could be significant. Five, seven, eight. May 78 or August 57 could be significant. Five of Swords. Somebody is mentally ill here and they're obsessed with sex. They're obsessed with hurting someone sexually. That's what I'm getting. These cards coming out together like this. All of these cards here in a row coming out like this. They talk to me of a rapist. Absolutely. And this could be a fire sign specifically who's a rapist. Doesn't have to be. This is somebody who's very sadistic. Eight of swords. They want to tie somebody up. Yes, exactly. 58 could also be significant. Queen of Wands. Somebody's an Aries or a Leo. Taurus too. Aries, Leo, and Taurus. Maybe there are multiple people colluding to hurt someone. An Aries, a Taurus, and a Leo. Or somebody with Aries, Taurus, and Leo in their chart. 
seven of cups this person keeps fantasizing about hurting a woman sexually that's what i'm getting here or these people ten of cups this is very sinister because these could be a whole family fantasizing about hurting this person or this could be the family of the person they're supposed to hurt they could be family members who fantasize about this person being um, raped again ten of pentacles after i just said that ten of cups and ten of pentacles both of those are family cards so somebody's family wants this to happen to one of their own or this is a whole family wanting this to somebody else for somebody else yes so um, there's a man here who's colluding with someone's family members or his family members to hurt this person sexually. Yes, that's their obsession. The lovers. Yes, exactly. Confirmation again. Page of Wands. Again, this is a fire sign. A fire sign male, most likely. The moon, 18. And the Queen of Swords, yes, there is a fire sign who could be born on the 18th. Five of Cups. This person's coming back to apologize. This is a past person, somebody's ex, some kind of fling. A person from the past is coming back to apologize for something, for breaking the person's heart. 37. Somebody could be 37. So this person's coming back saying that they want to soothe this person's broken heart. But then we've got the tower. So they want to break the person's heart again after apologizing for breaking their heart. They're going towards a water sign possibly. Somebody who's very loving or somebody who's shown a lot of love to this person in the past. This man will be saying that he wants to marry this woman. That's what I'm getting here. He's going to propose to this woman and then abuse her sexually. That's what I'm getting here. Yes, that's the plan. And there's a whole family involved in making this plan. Could be this woman's own family or his family or both. Seven of Cups. Nine of Cups, the number 79 could be significant. Somebody could be born in 79, somebody could be 79. July and September could be significant. Yes, the gate 20. Somebody's waiting for this person to go somewhere. That's what I'm getting. A person is waiting for this woman to travel somewhere, the high priestess and the sun for the summer. Page of Swords and the Six of Cups. Somebody could be traveling with their children this summer. And that's when this past person wants to come in with the offer. Four of Swords reversed, but it won't work they won't be able to put this person to bed or to rest. Ace of Pentacles. You see how the Ace of Pentacles keeps coming out? Somebody wants to propose to this woman who could have children, or this could be somebody they've known since childhood. <sighs> Free of Pentacles, Page of Cups, and the King of Cups. So... This man was the Page of Cups, now he's the King of Cups, that's what I'm getting. They could have gone to school together with the Three of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. Or they went to work together in the past when they were younger, the Chariot. Again, somebody's traveling somewhere, possibly in July. And that's when this man wants to make his move, the Fool. Yeah, he wants to take a leap of faith. Nine of Wands. He wants to batter this woman. Sexually, that's what I'm getting. He wants to hurt this woman at all costs. So he's going to take a leap of faith. 
to try to get his mitts on her. This is an Aries man, absolutely. Knight of Pentacles, Three of Wands. Could be somebody on the cusp of a fire sign and an earth sign. Could be Aries, Taurus, or Virgo, Leo, or Sagittarius, Capricorn. Eight of Pentacles, the Devil, Capricorn. Somebody could definitely be a Capricorn. Sagittarius, Capricorn, Cusp, yes. Eight of Pentacles and the Devil are both Capricorn cards, but the 15th of August is in Leo season, so this man might try to do something in Leo season. 14 and 15. The 14th to the 15th of August could be significant. Nine of Swords, Four of Wands, Six of Wands, 46 or 64 could be significant. <sighs> Somebody is protecting themselves. This woman knows, with the High Priestess, she knows what this man's planning. Intuitively, she knows what's going on. The lovers, number six. This man's made a bet with some other men and women. The number 66 could be significant or the 6th of June. Two of swords. And the chariot. Somebody's making a decision to travel somewhere. Two of pentacles. So... Whether this woman's traveling or not this summer, this man will be traveling towards her. And it could be that he is um, aware of her whereabouts at all time because I was getting stalker vibes. This man is tracking this woman somehow. Either through her phone or something he could have planted in her car the 12th of july something could be happening on the 12th of july next week that's next friday i think look yes 12 7 12 7 queen of pentacles ace of cups reversed this man's going to make an offer possibly on the 12th of july and it's going to be turned down with the Ace of Cups reversed. This woman doesn't love this man anymore. Page of Wands, Queen of Swords, the Star. She's healed. So she could have been hurt by this man when they were younger. And now she's healed. So she's going to cut him off. Two of Pentacles. 22 could be significant Knight of Swords. This man's going to lose it. With the Two of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords, he's going to lose it when she turns him down. King of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. She, not she, he. He's going to act like a child. He's going to revert from the King of Pentacles to the Page of Pentacles and throw a tantrum. He might start to argue with her. We've got the king and the queen of swords, the king and the queen of pentacles. That's interesting how they are positioned like this. He might tell her that their counterparts, the magician, he might try to manipulate her. Yes, exactly. Ace of pentacles, ten of swords. This man's ready to put a sword through this woman. For, he wants to choke her or stab her. That's what I'm getting with the Four of Pentacles and the Ten of Swords. The woman could be a Virgo or a Libra. With the Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords. Could be an Aquarius. But you see how the Knight of Swords looks like he's attacking the Hermit. This man's going to get mad because he made a bet with his buddies that he's going to get this woman. And he can get this woman, no matter how hard he tries. And that's going to make him mad and try to hurt her. 
like I said, somebody wants to hurt this woman. Whether she says yes or no, he's still gonna hurt her. There we go. What's going to happen to this man? Let's see. Who keeps plotting on this woman? Knight of Pentacles. The Sun. He's going to be heartbroken. He has high hopes here. But they're going to be shattered. The 19th of March could be significant Pisces season. Seven of Wands and the Hierophant. God himself is going to stop him from hurting her. That's what I'm getting with that. With the Seven of Wands and the Hierophant. The Chariot. The police is going to arrest this man. 57 or 75 is significant. The Wheel of Fortune, 10. And Death, 13. The 13th of October is coming through again in the reading. There's a Libra who's involved in this. Six of Pentacles reversed. Either a Libra is about to arrest this man or call the police on this man. What about this Libra? This man and the Libra could have been doing something together in the past. That's how she knows. Because I think this is a woman. The Libra is a woman. She knows what he plans to do. The lovers. This Libra could be somebody he made the bet with or he gossiped with about what he's planning to do. He could have gossiped with both men and women. This man could swing both ways. That's another thing I'm getting here. He could have been pillow talking with both men and women about raping this woman. And one of the people he's been pillow talking with is going to alert the authorities possibly. Nine of Cups, yes. And the Fool. This man could have been drinking too much when he said something to a lover or lovers or to friends. This could have been a party, not necessarily an orgy, but it could have been an orgy too. But this man said something stupid at the party and multiple people know what he plans or what he's thinking about this woman. And they're going to alert authorities, yes. He's not going to be able to um, go through with this. The hermit, number nine. Especially since somebody's staying away from him. That's what I'm getting with that hermit card. Somebody's not accepting anything from this man, is avoiding him. He keeps trying to catch this person somewhere and he can't. The gate 20 at the door. Catching at the door. It looks like the hermit is just walking in through the door at night at the gate. This could be in an airport too. This man could be pretending like he's traveling somewhere because he knows that the other person is traveling. And they want to bump into this person in an airport possibly or when this person leaves their home. This man wants to travel towards this woman or he knows when she is traveling somewhere. Yes, it's true. Queen of Swords, the Star and the Four of Wands. Something could have happened on the set. 17th of April. This man's been trying throughout the year. He's been trying to get to this woman. Possibly in February, April, and May. May. Five of Wands, yes. 45 or 54 could be significant. Eight of Pentacles. He was working on getting to this woman in May. He tried to do something. In May too. Four of Cups, but it was rejected. 49 could be significant. Eight of Wands. He wanted to hurt this woman before. 
Again, he's obsessed with having sex with this woman. 81 could be significant or 18. The five of pentacles. He can't get to her. That's what I'm getting. We've got the hierophant and then the five of pentacles. God is keeping this man at a distance. God himself is keeping this man away from the woman. That's why it's not working. Page of pentacles. Three of cups. 43 or 34 could be significant. 35. Somebody could be 35. They could be a water sign. The lovers. Number six. This man's lover, one of this man's lovers is about to tell on him. Two of pentacles. The tower. This man could have done something on the 16th of February. Somebody could be talking about something which happened on the 16th of February. Something this man did on the 16th of February significant. Six of cups. 64 could be significant. Page of cups. He could have done something to a child or he asked the child to do something. 83 or 38 could be significant. Five of Swords and Strength. This man hurt a child on the 16th of February. He overpowered a child and hurt a child. This man's a pedo. He could be going after this woman because he's interested in her child or children. Because I was saying that this woman might have children at the beginning. King of Pentacles reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. Whoever this woman is, she has no more love for this man. This is somebody who loved him in the past. <coughs> Six of Cups. Ace of Cups reversed. 61 or 16 could be significant. Yes. Queen of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. This woman is either a water sign or an earth sign. There could be multiple women who resonate with this. Water signs, earth signs, and possibly air signs too. We had the queen of swords earlier. Yes. So air, water, and earth could be resonating with this. The devil. They have this man who's obsessing over them. King of wands with the devil. This man has a sexual obsession with a particular woman because he cannot have this woman possibly or he can no longer have this woman. And he could have made bets with people about this. He could have been gossiping about this woman saying that this woman's in love with him and he can get her to do whatever he wants and all that kind of stuff. And it's not true. That's why he's willing to force her into something just so he can say that they did something. Yes, the lovers. So we've got Knight of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles sticking out and the lovers. So he's willing to pay her or he wants to say that he paid her to do something. The lovers, yes, something like that. The Empress. So he wants to humiliate this woman. This is a divine feminine that he wants to treat like a prostitute. And get her to do things that she wouldn't normally do. Turn her out, as they say. The Wheel of Fortune and the Six of Cups. <coughs> and this man thinks he's going to get lucky. Because she used to love him. With the Six of Cups. Again, what I said earlier. Temperance, 14. He was trying to do something on Valentine's Day. Whatever he planned for her on Valentine's Day, he wants to do now. Four. Today is the fourth. He could even be trying something today. He keeps doing witchcraft on this woman. And her son, possibly. So, like I said, this man could actually be interested in her son. The magician here, this Aries man, is interested in someone's son. Or both. 
the mother and the son. Who knows? Yes, it's true. King of Swords, Ten of Cups, Page of Wands. So this man still has the mind of a child. That's why he's interested in children, maybe. I don't know. This man could have been abused himself as a child. Ten of Swords, yes, possibly. Eight of Pentacles and Page of Swords. Six of Swords. So he wants to hurt somebody's child when somebody's traveling. Nine of Pentacles, 89 or 98 could be significant. 97 or 79 could be significant. Somebody wants to do something for all time's sake. The Hangman, 12, and the Six of Pentacles reversed. So this man wants to perform some kind of BDSM with two people. Possibly with a mother and a child, Nine of Wands. Yes, he wants to hurt someone, again, with the Nine of Wands. The High Priestess. He wants to hurt the High Priestess. So this could be a message for somebody in the spiritual community. Multiple women in the spiritual community could have a person from their past obsessing over them. Watching their channels and plotting against them. Like I said, could be an air sign, a water sign, and an earth sign who resonate with this. Eight of Wands, Two of Cups, Seven of Swords. So again, he's coming in with the cups here saying that he wants commitment, but he just wants to have sex and run away. Seven, seven, warning, warning. So yes, he's coming in here with a cup. He could even be putting things in people's cups to make them dazed and confused. And then he takes advantage of them. King of Pentacles. And again, like I said, the man wants to say that he wants commitment, that he wants marriage. Temperance, 14. He wants a balanced relationship. He wants to balance the scales if there was an imbalance here in the past. So he's bringing, he could actually be bringing a ring. The world, 21. He could be traveling the world just to uh, do this. Or he's waiting when she's traveling somewhere. Like I said before. Anything else we need to know for today? Ten of Wands and the Star. The 17th of October is a date I see a lot lately. Somebody could be a Libra. This Libra could be in the public eye. They could have Aquarius in their chart. This is somebody with a very powerful destiny. And this man could be trying to steal the person's destiny through this sexual abuse that he's planning. Queen of Pentacles and the Magician, yes. He wants to do sex magic on this woman and possibly her child too. And steal their destinies. That's what I'm getting here. It's a sexual sacrifice that he wants to make. Six of Pentacles, 16 again, or 61. Somebody could be 16, somebody's child could be 16, or these people have known each other when they were 16. The Wheel of Fortune. So he can manifest abundance if he does this to this mother and child. Four of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. He could be struggling financially right now. And he will have the Ten of Pentacles if he do this. If he do this. <laughs> if he does this. <sighs> Three of Pentacles. Yes, he is a part of some kind of cult or coven with the Three of Pentacles. And that's how they manifest abundance. 
they worship the sun god or something of the sort. The hangman and they're sacrificing people to the sun god, I guess. Free of swords, yes, the hangman with the free of swords. So he has to make people bleed. So he practices some kind of BDSM where he makes these people bleed. Yes, that's what I'm getting. Six of cups and he does this to children. Yes. And he also wants to do this to someone from his past. Eight of swords. He wants to tie this person up. We said this before. There we go. Tied up. Bleeding. Free of swords and put a sword through them. 83 somebody be born in 83 i saw 83 before somebody could be 38 or born in 83 the page of wands so this fire sign male is either born in 1983 or he's 38 the page of swords the stalker king of swords so this man's been stalking for a very long time and he's stalking a child that's what i'm getting but he's also been stalking this person possibly since he was a child. So somebody's been siphoning another person's energy. Yes, it's true. The fool and the free of wands. He's been sitting there and stealing somebody's energy. Possibly for decades. And he can no longer siphon from a distance. So he's going to make a physical move towards this woman. He's no longer going to be waiting or he's waiting still, but he knows that she's traveling somewhere. And he's going to be waiting wherever she's going to try to seduce her. The number 33 could be significant. But again, the Four of Swords is in reverse. He can't put her to bed or to rest. It's not going to work. The Tower, 16. It's going to be a Tower moment for him because he's going to realize that he can't get her where he wants her. 43 or 34 again is significant. <clears throat> Four of Wands. He wants to get into this person's home or to get her to go with him somewhere. To his home or to a hotel where he can gang up on her. That's what he's planning. I'm getting something sinister with that chariot there. This man could be pretending to be a taxi driver when this woman tra travels somewhere. He could be coming to pick her up. Six of Wands victory, exactly. I got the message like this before, I think it was years ago, possibly two years ago, that when somebody's traveling somewhere, this person will be waiting at the destination, whatever the destination is, and they will be saying that I'm here to pick you up, to take you to your hotel or to your house or wherever they're going. Knight of Wands, again, this fire sign. A fire sign is doing this. A fire sign male. Four of Wands, more fire. Look, 34 again. The Chariot, seven. This is happening this July. Somebody's traveling somewhere in July. Either there's a woman traveling with her children this July on holiday or to visit relatives or she could be traveling to her hometown, however this goes. When she travels there, this man will be waiting there, possibly with his car, to take her somewhere. Because he wants to jump her. Death card. The gate 20. Again with the gate 20. This makes me think of an airport all the time. This could also be a door. Somebody has to go into a building or when they leave the building. I just saw 34, 34. Something about the number 34 is very significant. Either both of these people are 34 or something happened when they were 34 or 34 years ago. 
something about the address number 34 could be or a code for something could be on a license plate nine of swords and the empress the moon 18 the 18th of march could be significant pisces season there is a pisces who works with this man and this pisces keeps doing magic on another person's mind they're trying to control somebody's mind through spell work so that this person accepts to go with this man wherever he wants to go so there's another woman doing something in the background for this man there's some kind of mind control magic being done eight of cups justice 11 nine of pentacles the wheel of fortune 10 the queen of wands the two of wands and strength somebody stronger than this magic whoever the woman is could be a leo too or a leo is doing this leo pisces and libra could be doing this and an aries man but somebody stronger than the magic that's what i'm getting king of cups Ten of Swords. Somebody's very intuitive too. They know what this group is planning. Look at this with the lovers. There could be two women in particular who are planning and plotting with this man. There could be an older man too or an older woman. Six of Swords. Again, that's the plot for when somebody is traveling. The lovers... This man could also be going towards her himself. Is she traveling somewhere? Are these women, these could be multiple women, like I said, resonating with something similar. Is she traveling somewhere? Are some Knight of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Eight of Pentacles. Four of Cups. It could be that some of these women are not traveling, but he's coming towards them. He could be coming towards their workplace. And if somebody works from home, then they're coming to the home. Also, this man could be watching the reading and he could be changing his mind about what to do. Tower moment. Yes, exactly. He's changing his mind as he's watching this because he's being exposed for everything that he's planning and plotting here. Seven of Pentacles. This man could have been trying to do something for seven years and it never worked. So it's probably not going to work now. Five of Cups. Knight of Swords. He's getting very angry. He's sad and mad. And he's going to lash out. Because he's realizing that he cannot trick this woman into doing anything with him. Going anywhere with him. The Hierophant. Again, God is protecting this woman. That's why he cannot do anything. All his plans are falling apart for seven years again. Somebody's been doing this for a very long time. Two of Pentacles, because they're off their rocker, they're cuckoo. Again, Two of Pentacles with the Knight of Swords. This is somebody who's cuckoo. They're obsessed. The Devil and the King of Swords. This is a very criminal mind. I'm getting here, this is a criminal. Yes, they have the mind of a criminal. And the criminal cannot go through with the crime either. Page of Pentacles. The lovers. Again, he bragged to a group of people about what he's going to do to this woman. And these people are going to be telling authorities, possibly. Some of the people he bragged to could be watching this reading or they're watching readings because this man could be saying, oh, my ex is a tarot reader now. 
and uh, look what I'm gonna do to her. And other people could be watching tarot readers. Yes, who are the victims? Six of Wands victory. There are other people he's been talking to who are watching the tarot readers the man or men have been talking about. And they're seeing the truth about who their friend is. <laughs> 